All right, much of Brew About Nothing time. Playing some Curse Control in Standard. And one of these colorless lands is an Evolving Wilds, which means we can keep this. We do need to draw more black mana. At least one more black source for this grasp, but see what our opponent's doing. Canyon Slew. Well, let's grab our Swamp. Come on, Swamp. Lay bare the heart. Uh, two mana. Yeah, let's just lay bare the heart. I don't think our wall does a ton at the moment. Ooh, this is like Jund Aggro. We definitely need that other black source. Gifted Aetherborn can come down next turn. Grasp, whatever. Helion. So I think we take Tireless Tracker. Because that gives so much card advantage over the long game. And hope that we can deal with everything else. We do really need to draw a Swamp, though. Two colorless sources is not going to get it done. Because we need this Grasp to come online. Oh, dear. More things that need black mana. Well, let's go Thoughtseize mode. We'll take Gonti. So our opponent can play the Lath New Helion. The only good news is it doesn't actually live for that long. Because our opponent isn't going to have that much energy. We really need a black source. <laughs> like, severely. Because Wall can't even stop this gifted Aetherborn because it has Death Touch. There's the Aether Hub. So opponent's going to have three energy. That's still not a very long life for the Lath New Helion. Two turns. Well, two attacks. Here it comes. Opponent gets some energy. Gets in. Hits us. Down to 14. Come on, black mana. Come on, deck. You can do it. Black mana. Well, that is black mana. Alright, we'll do it this way. Play Wall of Forgotten Pharaohs. That's painful. <laughs> painful black mana, but it is black mana. Pass the turn. Another swamp for our opponent. A tune with Aether. Yeah, I think this means we gotta kill Lath New Helion, unfortunately. Since it lets the Helion live another turn. And there's a grasp. Yeah, we will... Just grasp back. And then we can kill the gifted Aetherborn, one way or another. Opponent gets in. Down to 11. There's a swamp. Alright, let's be a little greedy. Let's hop Nixilis and draw a card. Well, there's a Torment. The way this goes bad is if our opponent has, like, a Glory Bringer. Another Lath New Helion, I guess, would also kill Ob Nixilis, which would be pretty sad. Foreboding Ruins. Tapped. Alright, no Glory Bringer. Let's see if our opponent goes at us or goes at... They're just going at us. Not caring about Mr. Ob. Desert of the Glorified. Well, draw a card. Another Deadlands. One, two... I don't really want to murder that. I want to Dreadlands that, but it's so risky. Alright, play Deadlands past the turn. We also don't really have a way to gain life. So we can Blighted Fen if we have to. Lath New Helion. Well, we have to kill that. Opponent gets energy. Goes at us. Goes at us. So murder the Helion. Drop to five. We're definitely getting to the dead to glory bringer stage. Wall of Forgotten Pharaohs, eh? Well, draw a card. Ultimating Ob Nixilis might be one of our best bets. Alright, let's trim that down. Play a Swamp. Play Wall of Forgotten Pharaohs. Pass the turn. Well, we have a plan. It's not a great plan. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh Longtusk Cub. Alright, we can deal with Longtusk Cub. We can Ultimate Ob Nixilis. Uh, oh, oh boy. That was a good draw. Whew! Alright, we're in the game. We're in the game. I think we're going to three. I think we're doing it. I want to keep... Well, we can't use Obnixilis that much more anyway. Or we're going to kill ourselves. Alright, Emblem Obnixilis. <laughs> I think this is our best bet. Fatal Push Long Tusk Cub. Torment of Scarab's our opponent. Pass the turn. Come on, no hasty threats. No glory bringers. Until we draw re- Alright, that's actually good. Getting rid of the gifted Aetherborn does- Uh-oh. Did they just draw it? Why are they tapping mana already? What did they draw? 
Oh, Siphoner? Siphoner's fine. That's not a real threat. So, ping our opponent. Doomfall. I guess we just do this. Pass the turn. Opponents to 20. Opponents to 18. Alright, not dead yet. Hit our opponent to 17. Is this working? Hour of Glory. That's actually a pretty sweet draw. Pass the turn. Do we stabilize under this Torment? Hour of Glory kills any creature our opponent can play at instant speed. So that's a way we can get rid of a Glory Bringer. Opponents down to 12. Opponents down to 10. They were at 28 a second ago. Drana, Liberator of Malakir. Well, let's cycle the desert. Drain our opponent. Down to 8. Hit our opponent. Down to 6. Doomfall the Drana. There's a chance. Oh, there is a chance. If our opponent takes the damage here. Come on, take the damage. Torment, do they take it? This is this is the question. Oh, they discard a land. All right, we gotta wait one more turn. Opponent's down to four. No glory bringer. Cycle. Oh, we got there. We got there. Cycle desert. <laughs> oh, opponent takes two. Ping our opponent. Opponents to one. Untap. Ping our opponent. <laughs> Ah, uh, curse control! Wow! Wow! We were so far behind! And then we played a Torben and absolutely crushed it! That was pretty amazing. This deck is a lot sweeter than I thought. I mean, I don't know if this deck is good, but it's way sweeter than I thought it would be. So now we have the traditional question, to transform or not to transform. Just killing all of our opponent's stuff feels good. I think we're going to keep it roughly the same for this match. And then next match, uh, for this game, and then next game, see how our opponent sides boards, next game we could go on the creature plan if we want to. Um, We could bring just Gonti. Gonti seems reasonable. Gonti, I don't know about these Trespassers curses. Our opponent... Isn't going that crazy with creatures. Let's go down the Trespassers Curse. Try it like that. Uh, zero land... Well, desert. Zero untapped lands. I think it's too risky. I think we gotta ship it. Alright. Not a great hand, but... Fatal Push. I think we just need lands. Let's put Push to the bottom. We have a Grasp. Tap land for our opponent. Uh, there's a Swamp. So let's Swamp and scrutinize our opponent million creatures wow aggressive only two lands ether chaser makes energy what are we doing next turn our opponent's gonna play carry sev so take ether chaser leave the swamp on top pass the turn ether chaser makes energy to keep alive the helion so i think that's the right call there's carry sev so I think we take one hit from Carry Zev, Harsh Scrutiny, get rid of Tireless Tracker. Ooh. We'll keep Yohani's expertise, play a Swamp, pass the turn. Opponent. There's a Lath New Helion. Yup. Get some energy. Hits us for a lot. Uh, seven? Seven is a big number. Down to 13. So, play Evolving Wilds, pass the turn. Now we gotta decide... Well, what's our opponent have? Gifted Aetherborn, okay. Well, I think we kill Lath New Helion. Because we can Expertise away the rest. So we drop to 10, get a Swamp. So I think next turn we Expertise, clear the board. Then we get to follow it up by Gonti and maybe steal something sweet. Opponent passes. And eh, never to return's not bad. So, Yohani's expertise. Get rid of the dorks. Somewhat stable. At 10. Another land. And. Uh, Garrison. Alright, well, we gotta never that. So, we gotta wait on Ganti. Kill Garrison. Hope that our opponent kinda whiffs this turn. Because we are out of removal. Oh dear. 
that's the absolute worst thing that our opponent could have drawn for us to have a chance. Down to six. We'll play Gonti. Take up Nixilis. Uh, oh, that glory. No. Something else? Oh, my goodness. Jeez. Exerts Glory Bringer. Yeah, we're... Well, let's see. I guess if we draw land... So we're kind of not completely dead. We get to play the Obnixilis. Kill the Glory Bringer. Which means Ronas can't attack, so we need our opponent to whiff here. Alright, it's a land. So draw down to one with Obnixilis. Kill Ronas. Pass the turn. Well, we die to anything and everything. Wouldn't mind finding an instant speed removal spell for a glory bringer. Well, play Gonti. Grab something. Opponent kills it. Come on, good hit. Good hit off Gonti. Alright. More Gontis. Gonti for Gonti. Pass the turn. Can't, can't activate... Obnixilis. Opponent. Alright, kills Obnixilis. That's actually not bad. Obnixilis was just a removal spell since we're at one life. Opponent passes. I think we're going to be a little greedy. Torment of Scarabs. Start draining our opponent. Hope that they whiff here. Down to 17. Alright, makes a zombie. Desert of the Glorified. Hmm. So if we Gonti, we lose to a removal spell. I think what we do is lay bare the heart. Take Rampager. Cast the Gonti. Get... Dragon Master Outcast sounds good. Wish we had an untap land. Play Desert. Pass the turn. Oh, come on. We just put a bunch of non-lands to the bottom. Come on, draw a land. We're dead to removal spell this turn. Opponent. Passes. Play Dragon Master Outcast. I think we just gotta be greedy. Get rid of... Glory Bringer, doesn't really matter. Make a zombie. Pass the turn. We gotta fade one more turn. One turn. No glory bringer. Man, if we stabilize it one life. Opponent discards a tune. Come on. No whammy. No whammies. Opponent. Passes. Oh, we should have cycled. Well, we're making dragons. It's dragon time. Another desert. Another torment of scarabs. Oh, we definitely should have cycled, but that's alright. Get in with our zombie. Opponent blocks. Now we're not dead to Glory Bringer. Double Torment triggers. Opponent discards a Long Tusk Cub. Do they have Burn? What's their out? Opponent's passing. Curse Control! Cycle of the Desert. Obnixilis, not exciting. Make another Dragon. Five, six, seven. Yeah, let's get him for seven. Pass the turn. <laughs> two Curses and two of our opponent's cards. Oh, definitely should have attacked with Dragon Master Outcast. That would have been lethal. Oops. And it doesn't matter. We <laughs> oh, apparently the deck works. I don't know why. It looks so janky. It's so cheap, but Curse Control, <laughs> it's, it's actually beating people. Uh, sweet, I guess. Thanks for watching the video! If you haven't already, take a minute and click that subscribe button. It's a great way to support the channel for free, and you'll find the next video in the playlist right here.